The 1990s was a period of rather friendly relations between the United States and Russia. Uh, between uh, President Clinton's uh, inauguration in 1993 and uh, President Boris Yeltsin's resignation in 1999, uh, the two heads of states met 18 times, uh, which is uh, nearly the same amount as uh, all heads of states during the whole uh, entire Cold War period. Uh, and uh, they hit off quite well and they had a good uh, working relationship. Uh, but of course, uh, they also disagreed over some issues and Kosovo was one of them. Um, so uh, President Russia Boris Yeltsin didn't approve of uh, the bombing of Serbia, for example. Uh, but, at this, but at the same time, uh, they, they managed uh, to cooperate on other issues. Uh, and uh, likewise, uh, uh, President of U.S. Uh, Bill Clinton uh, did not endorse um, uh, the bombing of Chechnya during the Second Chechen War uh, uh, that happened a few months after uh, the NATO bombing of Serbia, but uh, still uh, they managed to keep their lines of communication open. So it did not dramatically damage uh, the U.S.-Russia relations to the same extent as um, more recent events.